as you saw in the previous clip, <clears throat> I got my nails done today. It's Thursday, August 27th. Ow, mother. It is almost seven o'clock, 6.51 p.m. I, today is my Friday. I have tomorrow off because I'm headed out of town, but not really out of town. But it's four hours away, but it's still, you know, DC, Maryland, VA, DMV. <sighs> headed to Virginia Beach. So again, I had to get my nails done. I just ate um, some crab legs um, and I had some wine uh, and now I need to pack but I don't feel like it because I have wine <laughs> and the wine is kicking in and I just want to take like a nap. I already have laid out, I did a list, I was good, I did a list of what I needed to take or what I wanted to take with me. Um, we're leaving tomorrow and come back Sunday. So check in tomorrow, check out Sunday. We are not leaving until like I'm no later than 12 tomorrow. So I don't have to get up dumb early. Um, I do have time to get up in the morning and do things, but I think I want to fold, at least fold the stuff tonight maybe go ahead and pack it because tomorrow i just want to chill i do have to um it's my friend's birthday so i want to go to target in the morning and get the birthday gift together when we get to virginia beach hurricane laura is supposed to hit on Saturday. But we were not like in the, like Virginia Beach, like the DMV area, DC, Maryland, VA, Virginia, was not like in the direct path of it. We're supposed to get the remnants of it. So we were like, let's just go anyway. And um, if we're just stuck in the hotel for that one day, it would just like be, it would be the same as being at home and in the house with rain. So we decided to go ahead and, you know, living dangerously. So we're gonna go just for change of scenery. And, you know, school starts Monday for one of the kids, so. It's my last hurrah, if you will. And yeah, so not too much going on. I think I only included this part because, again, I went and got my nails done. And I had me some wine. And the bottle just happens to be right here. <laughs> but I want to show y'all the wine because it's delish. This is the Chateau St. Michel Harvest Select Sweet Riesling. It is 11% alcohol. Now, normally we get the Chateau St. Michel, just the Riesling, which is already good by itself. The regular Riesling is 12%. It's either 12 or 12.5%. And I almost got that. But when I was at Giant, Giant is the grocery store for those who are not in the area, they had the regular Riesling, the dry Riesling, and the sweet Riesling. And I was like, I don't think I've ever had the sweet Riesling before because the regular Riesling is sweet enough. This is delish. Like, it's a small bottle, you know. We kind of heavyweights around these parts. So, I don't know. I have my lights out in here. I don't like a lot of light. It is like right at the top of the label that's how much i had two cups didn't even fill the cups all the way this is the cup i was sipping out of i was filling it like to the top of the words on the cup so you don't get a lot but it's worth it and i think it was i threw the receipt away but i think it was it was either it was somewhere between nine and twelve dollars at giant at the grocery store you might be able to find it cheaper at the liquor store but that's how much it was at Giant. So, 
I am going to, you know, do what I need to do so that I can chill out the rest of the night and, um, yeah, get ready to road trip it again <laughs> tomorrow. I feel like I've been doing a lot of road trips. I haven't, but it just feels like, you know, just feels like that. I really haven't been. Well, yeah, I went to Atlanta City and then I went to Philadelphia. So this is the third road trip in a month. But I'm not complaining. It's been fun. So that's what we're doing. Okay. Instead of you know, get another charger cable for this gap down phone, I'm gonna get this wireless one. Because apparently it's compatible. Try that out. Then I'm gonna put the other one back. Whoops. And I got a new thing for my watch because I'm sick of this white band. Okay. Alright, now we can get back to the Perfect. Not a whole lot of people around. Everybody is distant. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect little weekend getaway. So we're just going to sit out here until it's time to catch the sunset. So that's like a couple hours. Oh no, it's like an hour. And then we're going to go get some eats. Gonna get dressed up, get cute, and go see and be seen. in the morning Saturday August 29th it's 723 <clears throat> it's not that early but it's early enough <clears throat> got up early to watch the sunrise and now I'm getting ready to get some breakfast because why not we're already up I'm completely covered because it's early but I think I have a look I have a look going but the face ain't right. <clears throat> Just trying to pay the meter. But this is where we're going. That little blue building back there. Pocahontas Pancakes. Known for their breakfast. So we're going to give it a go. pancakes <laughs> I thought the blueberries were gonna be in the pancakes but oh they are okay and then they put some more on top side of the bacon good crispy bacon like I like it and a she crab omelet with hollandaise sauce yummer
Virginia. And last day of vacation. Vacation, staycation. Last day of this beautiful view.